I can't do it. Babe, can you turn the other way? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about products that you can buy to build up a makeup kit. This is a makeup starter kit. So these are some of the products that I've started makeup off with and that I've actually really enjoyed. When I was collecting products for this video, I realized that a lot of these things are my favorite and I use them all the time, almost every day. There are some products here that I cannot live without, so I got quite a few things to talk about, so let's just get started. So the first thing I'm going to talk about is the L'Oreal True Match. This is the original foundation, and I have the shade N3 Natural Buff. I suggest this foundation over many others because of the wide range of colors that are available. It's a really affordable um, drugstore foundation, and... Like I said, um, the, there's lots of colors, perfect for anyone, and it is a light, sheer coverage. It's not going to make you look cakey, it's not going to make you look like you're wearing a mask or anything like that, and it really holds on to the rest of your products really well. So, this is a really good foundation if you're starting off in makeup, but if you are a teen or someone younger and you have perfect skin, God bless your soul. Let's just start off with concealer. This is the Maybelline Master Conceal in the shade Light. I really like this concealer for under the eyes and also blemishes if I have any. It works really great with my skin and it does a really good job of covering up dark circles. So this is a really good product. And you're going to need something to set that concealer with. This is the CoverGirl Clean Powder. This is actually for formulated for sensitive skin but they do have one that is for um, oily skin and also one that is mattifying which I'm not too sure if it's the same thing but um, these are fairly new products and they did come out with a wider range for other skin types which is really good so this one is classic beige and I really like to set my under eyes with this powder it's very creamy, very smooth, and it doesn't look cakey on my skin, which is amazing, which is what any girl needs their powder to do. So, Moving on with face products, I'm going to show you guys here. This is the Maybelline Master Contour, and I know not all girls are going to be into contouring and highlighting, but if you're just into the blush, it has that option as well. But if you're looking to kind of venture off into the whole highlighting and contouring, Instagram makes it look really good and really easy, you can just get this and you'll have all three in one. Even if you don't use them all at the same time, this works really well. Um, the contour shade is really nice. It's a matte color and it's not too dark. So, yeah. And then you have the blush, which is a really nice pinkyish shade, very general, and an awesome highlighter, which is really, really good, as you can see there. And yeah, you can just get it all in one shot in one palette and minimizes having to buy different things and even storage. So this is a really good starter kit item. I would definitely suggest picking this up. Moving on to the eyes, this is one of my holy grail products. I use it 
every day even if I'm not wearing eyeshadow I will definitely use this product this is the essence I love stage eyeshadow primer and I use this like I said every single day even if I'm just putting powder over top just to make my eyeliner look a lot nicer this is awesome great drugstore product don't skip out on this moving on to eyeshadows uh, I know not every girl is gonna be into eyeshadows from the beginning but hey I'm just putting it out there so just in case you want to pick something up um, these eyeshadow six pans are amazing as you can see I have a bunch of them here this is the blue one of a neutral one a dark black anywhere shimmery pinks browns and a little taupe color I love these eyeshadows the pigmentation is insane and as you can see there's a great variety in different shades different things that will work really well for you and I mean eyeshadows is definitely something that any girl can fall in love with and want to pick up but these are like four or five dollars each so it's really affordable and and these six pens are made to work so that you can use them all together and they will coordinate nicely so yeah I really like these eyeshadows don't use them as often as I should but I will definitely start using them more and I suggest you pick these up great value for the price moving on another holy 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 grail item for me something that I use almost every single day is the NYC liquid eyeliner and I know a lot of people are gonna be like I can't do liquid eyeliner but you know what at one point I couldn't do it either so sit down one night and mess around with it and try your best over and over and over again the great thing about this is that it's not waterproof which is also a minus but it comes off really easily so if you mess it up you can fix it and try again don't be discouraged give it a try you won't regret it and it's like four or five dollars so like come on keeping on with the eyes is mascara this is actually the first product that I've ever used when I stepped into the world of makeup mascara is the way to go if you have an eyelash curler and a mascara wand tube whatever you want to call it that's all you need honestly mascara is the way to go especially if you have your really beautiful lashes this is the rocket by Maybelline this is also the waterproof version which I really like for summertime because my eyes tend to water a lot but I also like the L'Oreal Miss Manga mascara and I have a couple other ones that are also really great Maybelline is definitely my favorite so don't sleep on this mascara it's really really good Moving on to the last three products and also the last category, which is lips. I'm not going to go into so much detail about the lipsticks that you need because you really don't. I mean, honestly, I didn't start wearing... Let's go again. Honestly, I didn't start wearing a bunch of lipstick until I was really into makeup, so let's just go with the Carmex here. This is a regular lip balm. It's really good for your lips. It's moisturizing and... It's easy <laughs> but if you're like a girl like me and you really like to discover more makeup products and everything makeup related I would definitely suggest from the drugstore the NYX soft matte lip creams this is the color that I'm wearing on my lips right now this is the shade Antwerp and I really really love the formula of these liquid lipsticks from the drugstore I haven't tried any of the other ones definitely want to try the Maybelline ones but these are definitely my favorite and they're about like five dollars give or take and they last all day as you can see the pigmentation is really great and I love them last but certainly not least and probably the most important product besides mascara is definitely lip gloss this is the Maybelline color elixir in the shade caramel infused definitely my favorite lip gloss formula from the drugstore this color is really neutral but it still has slight pink undertones and it works really well for many different skin tone skin tones and it's a lip gloss so it's easy to put on comes off when you eat lunch and then you just put on some more again so yeah that is 
everything that I have to talk about. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, and let me know what your makeup starter kit products are and what works well for you. Please leave a comment down below and don't forget to check out my social media. I will have that linked at the end of this video and in the description box below. And yeah, thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video.